Aya, naweza chukua mic. <laughs> Na usijaribu kuweka hizo background sounds zako za huko nyuma haya. Sasa clearly nimesikia me for me nimesikia pamoja na nyinyi both sides nyako called uh, okaro hunting witch hakuna mtu anayezataka kuitwa omuchawi na yeye nani okaro akamuita nini retired hooker hakuna mtu anayezataka kuitwa yeye ni retired ashawo sasa two wrongs do not make a right watu wametusiana kwa hivyo watu wa kujustify hakuna mwenye ametusiwa ti which si matusi enda uambie mtu akusalimi yangi akuitange sasa mchawi sasa mchawi uniambie kama utafurahia we move on swiftly now eh, mimi nenda kwa tinted tinted unaingililia vita ikuhusu unaingia pale kwa dress mtu na sauti wewe sauti yako yenyewe ya chrome na sigara inakoroma hata kushinda generator unaongea una address mtu ako na hela zake mtu ame pump money in that foundation ya huyo president wenu una address mtu ako na hela zake kama <laughs> ni kazi ya moderator unatafuta urudishwe ulikanyagishwa kubwa kubwa enda upepetee fan kwa yeko huko tu ndio unaweza pata kutu kwa kuomoka Watu wanajingisha nyi watu kuna watu wanajingisha kwa hii vita wanatafuta seat wanataka ile cheo wanataka cheo ni cheo anatafuta the other one anaitwa nani huyu wa alinunulia anti slippers za Uganda anaitwa nani amejiita ati <laughs> what is 50000 gigi gigi ati umesema what is 50000 ati unazarudisha hiyo sauti ya kurudisha pesa ulitoa wapi? Ha? Huh? Ata imagine hata uko na hata kama uko na pesa you can still not buy class. Huh? Zero class. Nada. Haya. Hiyo address nani amepatia nyako? In short, alikuwa na tusi nyako lakini ana mtusi na class. Yaani it was a read. Munaona venye watu wengine wanatukana nanga matusi. Kuma mako, sijui nini? Wendo kadinywe. Sijui nini hizo matusi? Kuna watu wanatusi mtu na class. Anakutusi vizuri yani bako nasikia aibu. Mumeona venye ukaro ameongea mpaka hata nimehurumia nyako. Enyo nimehurumia kwa sababu ametusiwa na facts za ati alipoa pesa, amebaiwa panti. Enyo mimi sizi takamtu anitusivo. Honestly, I'm very sorry. Mimi si zitaka mtu anitusiivo fadhali hata I think kunitusi na hizo mamkundu the chikunichietha nini nini hizo zote lakini usinitusi na facts benye mimi ni maskini retired haya mwingine achukue mic Mimi naweza uleza okaro what did you mean by saying umembaya panti umemlishia watoi eh because you know For me I can say vile mlikuwa mna argue hapo the argument kwani was it really from big daddy ama mko na issues wewe na nyako because what i understand with you na nyako mlikuwa mme make peace na ukaenda kwa ile level kasema unabu pia mimi siezi pendo bana mtu akuja niambia dharani unanibu kama nimekublo nimekubo you just block me and forget about me unijisema unakuja kwa level kwa ulizo kwa nini una fight na nyako because you umempata ko boring that's why you start fighting her for me upon tona kuna muko na another issue apart from yeye yenye mna mnapigania hapa maybe kuna something you book explain for us where you said i bought for you panties and ninakulisha watu hii ebu please fafanua hapo ndo mimi and before okara okay and listen eh there is a difference kuambia mtu una anakulisha watu hii hiyo si matusi kama ni kweli ulipewa pesa yake ana haki ya kukwambia hivyo kitu ya ku, ata, kama utaambia watoto wako ni umbwa mtoto wako ni malaya mtoto wako ni panya hiyo ndo matusi but hapa nataka nigeuze na nirekebishe kusema unalisha watoto hii that is not matusi that is not matusi cuz mnapendaga kusikia mtoto akisema mtoto ukisikia mnasema mtoto tayari hiyo ni matusi kama mwingine nilimuuliza wewe na kuonaga unashindaga live toka asubuhi mpaka asubuhi na una watoto Unapatiaga mzee saa ngapi nini morning glory? Kwani hawa watoto uliwapata through osmosis? Ametukania watoto. Ametukania watoto. You have to know the meaning ya kutukana watoto na meaning yenye ambayo unaambiwa. Thank you. Kwa hivyo watu wasiseme watoto when they ni huko. Ah tuendelee. Luna, there's no hidden meaning. 
the Luna comments, there is no hidden meaning. I meant what I said and I said what I meant. And my question, Okaro, Nyako anasema ulimpatia only 50k. And wa unasema uli changa pesa mob sana kwa, kwa, kwa foundation. Sasa, where is the truth, Apo? Kindly. Kuna mali nilisema nimechanga pesa mob or amount or number. Si kusema number. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Kita kusema number, semi number. Mimi ni I have already said what I said and I meant it. And I'm not taking anything back. And kwa hiyo mchango vile ulichangisha, ulichangisha mainly kwa nyako insaidie or you send it through Churchill isaidia watoto wa nyako kwa street. Did you send it kwa foundation ama ni kwa watoto wa street? Because anasema ulimtumia pesa kama ako Kenya. Kenya alifanya nao pesa staki kujua. Kama ato litupa kwa chua, litumia kama tissue paper staki kujua. Mimi yosi shidangu. I've said what I've said. There is no hidden meaning here. What I've said is what I've said. It's plain, black and white. Okaro, yes, I have... Yes, Jakarta, but you mainly... Ulisema, you sent her the money. Dona kuuliza, because you sent her the money, alikuwa Kenya. If you wanted to send her the money in Saidi, unge mtumia kama ako Germany, but mainly you sent it because alikuwa Kenya. Really? So I'm asking, Are you serious, you Vanessa? Vanessa, are you serious? <laughs> Vanessa, Jesus. Oh my God. Si tajiri, hata saizi nataka mchango. Mchango ni lazima. And I meant when I said it, I will never let her be homeless or go hungry. She has my phone number. Maze Vanessa umelibwaga. Ati? Abeuliza ati kama mbona ukumpa pesa o, o, nini o, ulimpatia pesa ati kama ulikuwa unataka umpe pesa ya kusaidia so ungempatia kiwa German kwani mwenye amekuja Kenya ni mwingine tofauti na mwenye ambaye amebaki German ni tofauti ama ni wewe mtu mmoja <laughs> akimpatia kiwa South Africa ama akimpatia kiwa akimpatia akipea kiwa Dubai nani amepatiwa ama nyako wako wangapi oh really Please, ada kama mpendi mtu, ama mpendi angi ukweli Sometimes you have to see that Mimi wache ni wambe gugu, I will make you to reason Amta bweka bweka hapa You have to reason, when unapiana Ninyo yako, reasoning yako You have to sit down kwanza and calculate my dear Siku bweka, just bweka ring Hapa kwangu kwa nti mtatulia Hapa ni itawafundisha eti kweti Are we together? Hapa mtaka na adabu Vanessa nimekupatia another chance. Uliza swali ngine. Ye nyambayo iko na uzito. Anti niko na swali kabla fikire. Swali mi nataka. Niko na swali nye. Forget about the money. Forget what has happened today. Let's go back down in history. Okaro. I, you guys used to be on a mutual ground with Nyako. Wee, Chief Ngoda. Atu wako na lepia. Nitaanguka soon. I don't depend on you, Google. Wafikine nye mulembo mu nitafutienge followers. I don't. I always come here. Kwanza tani mbona na waste time yangu na meza na waste mate yangu. Ya ni nye watu ndo wakuniambia. Ati ni tanguka. Nanguka hapi? Do I even depend on you guys? Do I even simp to you the way people are simping to you? Ati, oh, you know Gugu. Kwanza Gugu, who's Gugu? Wea msinilete sura nyinyi. Wea, I don't depend on you guys. I don't. Nyo nyo mna kujagapa kwangu wata sijumu na kujanga kwangu fanyanga nini? I feel like hata ninge kwa naeza juwa gugu ni nani ni wabloku kwa inje na tubaki na watu wenye abawa kuna maana zao. I don't even, I don't even like depend on you. And then uko kwa kina naniyo? Kwa kina, ati? Mwakio mbwone uliomba gigidole msama, eh kwa mba msama sivibaya. Hata ndo jana imeleta ishu. Kwa mba msama guys sivibaya. Okay? I will ask a million times. Mkomba msama kwenu sasa unaona. You know how how gugu you think. So pia kwamba msama ni makosa. Manze? So ukisikia recording. I hope mta tae post YouTube. Ishi dayote meletwa because... Sawa nitafungwa, nitaenda nifungwa na nitatoka. Ama kufungwa nitafungwa milele. 
issue that I may have to do at Diana and Meru Priti or Limak Kings. I have to do at Diana and Meru Priti and Marafiki. Watch up or to Jafika. Bad or to Jafika too. Nata ni kifungwa ni mimi dota fungwa, ok? Sio wewe utafungwa. Na nitaingia jela ni malize siku za mna nitatoka. Ama, siju kwa nini mwa mnawashuanga mara koti, mara kufungwa. Please guys, stop. That is none of your business. I don't depend on you Googles. You have to respect my platform. Are we together? You respect what people say. Kwa sababu pale, muna, it's not neutral. Mahali mmetoka. Si mna mtuka na okaro nyinyi. Even Onesmas was laughing while Nyako was insulting Okaro. See, are you even neutral, you guys? Because you want everyday people to be on your side. Eh? You want everyday people to be on your side. Wakati uya kitukano, kama kwele angekwe yuko safe. Se angekwe bedu yuko kwa yu, ako kwa yu group. Nini ni nini? Walim drop kwa nini? Kwa sababu, iyo ni makosa sana. Na hao ni wanawake wenye ambao wako wapo pia. Sasa wewe unakuja kuniambia mimi hapa. Yes, Matusi was being both side. Yes, and that's what we are talking. Eh? We are talking like this. Nasikizeni, mimi msilisubuwe, nakwambia hapa, ni mimi mwakio na mimi mwakio. Hakuna mtu wapata mtatiza akili. I don't depend on Google. Mimi mweza sasa siwezi taka shilingi enu. Kwa zaapo unajua mko, pale mko, unapitia sana. Me, I have my friend who is a, who lives in Saudi. She lives in Saudi. Says that I'm a chilingi. I feel pity for you. Huh? I feel pity. But I'm gonna have to talk about one and our milk. But I'm gonna have to go to the house and get beer. Hmm? Talk to me, Papa. I just don't know what you're doing, Yes, go, go, go. Go. Allah. Anyway, let's continue, guys. Go, go, go. Munafikiri mutakuja msumbue watu katika easy platform. Nini kina nani? Who are you? Mkwa ni mkona ukona wama Chinese. Ndwa mmekuja pa mtu sumbue. Muna sumbua nani nyinye? Muna sumbua nani? Wah, nita kutafuna kama vile natafuna higi zeri. Msinileta pa munafikiri hati kila mali mtaenda mna ugopewa. Na nani? Nana neza ugopa nyinye? You respect my platform. Kama mtakuja na adabu kwe ndeni huko. Huko. Huko kwa, kwa nini kwa groups zengine. Mzifikira pa mimi nitawabembeleza hapa. Tabia zenu hizo mbovu mnafikira eti nitazibembeleza. Nita I'm not here for views. I'm here to talk with the people. Wenye ambao tunaeza reason. Pamoja. Sio kubweka bweka hapa. Kwa nza mwana mwandiki gugu gugu. Ebu wekeni, nikule igideri yangu. Gugu, ebu wekeni, nikule la, nikule deri. Gugu, weka, weka, araka, nakule igideri, araka. Hmm? Gugu, weka. Kwa ndeni uko. Ndeni, wanda, tumwa bloka pa muishi. Yani tunaonyesha, we don't even need your behaviors. Kwa ndeni, Aya, ni 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 ni. Na hizo behavior zenza bweka 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 bweka. Anyway, tuendele. Anyway, okaro, make it go back. Anti point, anti point. Ukiona wanaika hizo machozi funga comments. Nisha funga na moderator wangu, watu wako rada. Kwa ndani uko tuwe nupumba vwenu wapa. Nilikuwa na uliza okaro swali. Ya, aturudishe, turudi nyuma penye urafiki ulikuwa alikuwa na msupport na msaidia wanaongea where did things go wrong until there until this point where we are today where did things go wrong mm, mostly is a disrespect ndogo ndogo madara ndogo ndogo mimi sipendi madara and uh, i think one major one kuna time alikuja kwa alikuja kwa bigi Alafu, tulikuwa tunafu. We were doing something, and she interrupted. Na, vile interrupts, uh, I didn't want to deal with it. Nika shuka, nika enda. Na, vile tu, nika shuka, nika enda hivi. She made some snack remark. So, ever since then, every time alikuwa nga kikuja hapo, na shuka, na enda. And every time nika shuka, na enda, she makes snack remarks. 
kuna nitatafuta hiyo recording mali anasema atakuwa na feel like i was looking down on her mtu alimuuliza walikuwa na merupiti let's kwa kwa mabui bui i don't know if you guys remember that life walikuwa mwa mabui bui na wakiongea and merupiti asked what she nini shida yako na ukara akasema she always felt like i was looking down like nikunga na like nimemdarau like looking down on her or something or rejecting her or something like that she felt rejected by me that's what she said i felt rejected by her again it's the same thing not respecting someone if someone doesn't want to be around you they don't want to be around you it's that simple but she makes it to be a biggie i don't want to be around i don't want to be around you i'm bored of you i'm bored of you just leave me alone it's that simple Na gugunation mnafanya nini hapa? Wait a little bit. Baby wait, wait. Wait guys, hebu chukweni mic side ndio na mic hapo mimi naongea na simu please wapenzi. Please your please. Master, your master is live. Your master is live. What are you guys doing here? Can I talk? Yes. Uh, Okaro, first I want to thank you because uh, you have chose to be a good friend to Diana and to start with the Diana, uh, not because you support what she is doing, but uh, the good friend will stand with you in good and bad time. Uh, the other thing is uh, uh, you didn't do good when you called us maskini. That was not a good word because uh, I understand, yeah, I was following the life and I know it was not too easy for you to see all the people against you or abusing. Them. Yes, no, don't say but it. You say it. You understand uh, that people were insulting me and I was defending myself. They insulted yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, sure. I understand. I understand very well. This, this, I understand, but you couldn't find a good word to use not uh, to put the people down because not all no, the people are No, the right word. Maskin was the word I wanted. Okay, and the other thing is, okay, yeah, you supported Nyako. That's very good, but uh, you could include the children because I, it's not a good word. Uh, the other thing is, for the Google Nation, I couldn't tell you it's the time to tell your boss to wake up, uh, call us and go to work because it's about to fall down. Everything is going down. The Nyanko now, she has to open up her eyes. She has received a lot of money from the people. She has done nothing. We can see she has done nothing. For me, I have no problem when I see the people supporting her. It's really quite okay, but she don't use the brain, you know. If you get the money, try to do something to make the people feel like what they are supporting you, you are doing something which is can make you better. But we can't give you the money to see you going to buy the, to eat a big hotel or to sleep in a big hotel or to, to want a big life. And we are down, we are struggling, we want to support you, but you're not uh, opening up your mind. We will not keep on giving you. That's what she needs to understand. And it's time for her now to wake up her house and go to work. Otherwise, the things are not going in a good way. She lost a very good uh, person, she lost Loso, and she will lose many many people who support her because nobody will support you and you put them down all the time so that's all Swahili will do uh tabi uh Heskan Swahili will do i don't know how to speak Swahili tabi i'm sorry i don't come from mobasa i come from kenya but not mobasa mobasa they can speak better Swahili more than me do you have another word I'm also a very nice person, but I know how to react back. Someone else? 
uh, oscillate uh, feeling i have no feeling stress i have no feeling if the, if the right time for the nyaku to wake up i could us and go to work someone else kunilishias okay uh, you do, do you contribute really i contribute for the people who who have the open mind i don't contribute for the people sitting down and eat if you work i will contribute for you and don't close the don't close the uh the comment i want to answer them because i have the answer for them i work hard i don't have money but i work hard and when i give someone a small coin i want to see them working also trying to to uh, to wake up their hearts and go to work we don't support them to sit down we support them to make their life better that's all who is lo uh, losa is your mama someone here uh, losa losa is your grandfather ataki kuchoka ah yeah that's is true she don't want kuchoka true mwingine nana she get a gift every day she can afford to yeah but one day the gift will disappear nobody will give will keep on giving her uh, guys copy the link yeah okay she will remain with the god there is nothing like to remain with god here and nobody yes, will support you forever yeah yes, one, sasa. yeah umemaliza tupatie tiktok depression mic Ah yeah sorry thank you. Okay. Mama kukuchukua mic. Thank you so 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 much and mwakio kunileta tu ni mimi ndiye ninaongea. Nimesalamia kila mtu. Oh Karo it today I was so much. Mama kuku na usituka nani? In that life and um, uh, uh, nilikuangushia kidole. Let me just say like that. Tumekuarushana na wewe once in in lives before tukianzanga maneno Mama kuku wa usikizi na kuambia usituka nane kungua mic sasa. Hello, habari zenu? Mama kuku chukua mic. Unanisikiza? Eh tunakusikia sasa. Ah okay. Sorry si kwa nawasikia nilikuwa nimefikiria mmeniambia eh, na ndi mwakia anasemanga nini? Tusitumie maneno yengine ama naweza tumia yako kidogo. Je unataka kupongeza Karo oh, nini Ogaro? Eh sijui anti labda kujibu hapo. But ah. usitu jaribu tu. Ni 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 sio ninakuanga akeni ya mtu mwenye anaongea ama Usitukanane just uh, ah, mimi situkanani na toa tu opinion yangu kulingana na Okaro. Okaro ameongelea watu wengi. Okay, sawa. Chukua mimi. So, eh, what she talked today, I hope watu wenye mko na masikio pia nyinyi mtarushwa hapo mtarudi hapo kutukanwa siku nyingine. Eh, vile tunacho kusema ukweli, nyaka alikuwa anateseka before sana akuje kwa TikTok. Facebook wakawa na mchangia kila mahali akitoroka na pesa. So dango akuja kwa TikTok nimeona watu wenye wamesimama na hata kuna wakati mimi nikaambia Okaro kwa nini unarusha rusha pesa hivi tukakombana juu ya pesa ya Okaro she can say, eh, she can say that, that we did that tukakuwa sana mpaka big kidati akaingilia and then tuka make peace nikaambia Okaro sorry so nyako akikula kiti ya mtu ananga shukran maisha nyako imekuwa mzuri hapa kwa TikTok people they have really tried to help her Alafu leo Okaro anasema amemsaidia na anakuja anasema only 50,000. 50,000 unaokota wapi kwa parapara? Kenya kuna shida simechaa kila mahali kila mtu analia shida ukimpatia hiyo 50,000 atakushukuru the whole year. Alafu we mtu anakupatia tu hivyo hivyo alafu nasema what is 50,000 Kenyan shillings. So what size natakana mfungue macho mjue ya kwamba this is not just a war. It is a kitu ya kuonyesha people that does not appreciate on these streets. Kuna watu wengine hata kama alisaidiwa kitu kidogo they always appreciate. And we have seen those people who appreciate a lot na wanasaidia watu wengine back home. Mi naambia watu wenye mnataka kusaidia watu wenye wako Kenya. Tumia watu wenye wako Kenya kusaidia watu wenye wako Kenya. Achana na watu wenye wako majuu. Today kitu yenye nyaka amefanya 
na matusi na watu wako na hiyo umbo ya Mseven that girl from Uganda ameingilia vitu wa Kenya amejifanya kuwa mkenya kabisa that umbo ya Mseven alafu anakuja anasema anaweza rudisha hizo pesa i know she cannot because wanakuanga na drama huko nyuma alafu hizo pesa wanampatia umbo ya Mseven ni nani umbo ya Mseven ni nani acha tolewa na moderator no nimesema hapa tukwe na adabu don't ambia watu hapa umbo wa m7 umbo wa m7 hana jina huyo mtu haya let's continue another person chukua mic mm. kwani nimepata nini highlights de 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 de. guys tap tap the screen huyu lele lady huyu lele j eh hey, jacqueline huyu ni nani lele lele hebu tumsikie alafu ameka picha mzungu yani lele welcome mwa anti mwakio wewe ni nani? Eh? Jambo. Jambo. Wajeni kuingilia president. Kwa nini unajita lele? Kwa nini wewe ni mwanamke? Mimi si lele. Mimi ni Lady Jacqueline. Eh? Mimi ni Lady Jacqueline. Mm. Mimi <laughs> Ehe. Najua najua kila kitu kinaendelea pole pole. Nieleze. Najua nimekuwa na kila kitu. Nieleze. Ni hapo nasema sijui president sijui atafute jobs sijui nini. Hiyo job si ati amekosa kazi. Moja usigeuze topic. It is about story na Ukaro vile walipigana na Onyako asubuhi. So can you talk about that? Ukaro kwanza kuwe na adabu. Haki ya Mungu Ukaro kuwe na adabu. Najua kwa hii live anchi ana nasikiza hata saa hii bado kwa kuwe na adabu Kuli, ukifuata hizi vitu zote mali zilitoka mpaka mm -hmm. mali zimefika mm -hmm. okaro needs to be very much conservative na jeshimu ajipeshi mazake mm -hmm. if at all she was a very wise woman hanga nyamaza hata ongea story hizi hizi vitu zote mm -hmm. ungesikia everything kikibianka alikuwa anaongea mhm mm na vile okaro sa, sa hii anaongea sa hii anajaribu kujiridim mm -hmm. okaro If I was wise, if I was okay mimi mwenyewe, ningenyamaza na singeongea hata kidogo. Mhm. Okaro, unaona anyamaze mtu amuingililie lakini amnyamazie. No, si ati mtu amuingilia lakini if she was a very wise woman. Mhm. Unajua alishaniku hapo nyuma. So, alishaniku hapo nyuma angenyamaza. Mhm. Angenyamaza na angenyamaza na angenyamaza hata milele hata zaidi anyamaza tu kabisa yote yote sita wewe nyamaza wewe ni mwanaume kwa vitu za wanawake ende utafute kazi ya mchengo unafanya nini hapa okaro do you know what unasikia sitegemei sitegemei badol zako ndio niingie kwa lives za za mwanaume kwa na kende na kwa majina ya wanawake wewe unasikia wewe ni ngombe sana umbo wewe ngombe shenzi afuta njina ya wanaume bwana ah haya tuendelee na wapatia opportunity ya kuongea lazima mweke matusi. Alafu mta. Huyu Masi si ajimute lakini. Ah. Watu wenye ambao wana vierere na kwa ni na kumute una jamute na kumute una jamute toka. Ala. Haya, tuendelee. Eh nani ameingia Diana Rose. Chukua mic aba lazima tusikize points zote hakuna kusikiza nataka tusikie point moja at least ndio ikuwe ni mjadala wenye ambao tunaweza ongea si kusaidia tena side moja mzuri diana good morning guys how are you doing everybody kila mtu mko sawa tuko sawa tunashukuru alhamdulillah nimeamka iko karo how are you doing nimeamka tu like about an hour ago eh squeeze ni nalala 
So Dove Mimi, is Kuri? It's healthy. Mimi Skia. I've listened to the recordings here because I I I you see when I miss case or lives. See see apa tuna tuna fanya analysis na tuna ta opinion nama. Huh? Yes, you're yes, honest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To go to my yeah. And um, I'm going to give my opinion uh uh based on the fact first of all because my main my name was mentioned. Kwanza, that's why. Now, uh, kitu ya kwanza nataka kusema, tukiongelelea eshima, tukiongelelea dignity, tukiongelelea lack of respect. I don't think even Nyako should sit on a platform to talk about those things because those are things that she does constantly. She disrespects people. She lacks that respect every day. That is what, that is her content, disrespecting people. You need the content yake ya kila siku. So she can't really demand or talk about respect coming from any space because her herself, her identity, her being on TikTok has been based basically on the lack of respect for people. Everything that she does. It is so clear even in the way she talks about only 50,000. It doesn't matter even if somebody gives you 1,000 Kenya shillings. That money has come to you. That money has gone to you. It does not matter what you choose to do with it. It does not matter where you put it. It does not matter who was reached out to for you to get that money. You got that money. The fact that somebody takes their money and gives it to you should be something you respect. It does not matter. Kama, kama how you respect your person, how kuitaka, you would have rejected it. And we are not even arguing about what you did with the money. It, it's not even important. We don't even care. The fact that you received money from someone, someone gave you that money. And then I even remember one time, she stood on a platform and said that Okaro promised her some money and she never sent it. The entitlement that Nyako has is what we all need to talk about. The entitlement. This person has put herself in a space where she's been receiving and getting money from people to a point that now she feels that she has a right to get money from people. Yani, it is her right to be given money. It is her right to be respected. It is her right to disrespect people. And it is her right not to be called out. It is her right not to be told when she's wrong. She's the untouchable, apparently. And she's the person that can never be corrected, can never be called out, can never be told anything. Anything she says is what should be taken. And she has really instilled this 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 attitude even in her followers. Yani unapata ata watu wafuasi wake wanakosa even objectivity wakiongea. Yani wanashindu ata kuongea even to be in any conversation because the only thing they talk about, unasikia kama uyu ametoka hapa sayi anasema iti, ati respect presda. Yani you talk about respect president while you know that this person this entity that you are obsessed about has no respect for anybody zero respect for anybody but then she demands respect if you disrespect people you will be disrespected tenfold that's going to happen you cannot demand for respect while you don't give it and that's just the truth we need to talk about. And another thing, th these people keep on bringing up the issue of Big Daddy and everything. Nani ajui Big Daddy hapa kwa TikTok na story za kutongozana na kila kitu. Why is Okaro being blamed for Big Daddy's behavior? Hata kama Big Daddy alienda kumtongoza, akaenda akamtumia message, akaenda akam akam hata wakinyonga. How is Okaro responsible for that? Ebu mniambie. 
to be honest like we, we if we are going to have a conversation why kama mtu ako na issue na ukaro si adil na ukaro how is ukaro responsible for big daddy and his behavior and then ati watu wa nani wanasema anani mfungwe ni comments ati wanasema ati ukaro ameenda ati 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 alienda kuvunja nyumba ya mtu <laughs> mnasahau huyu nyako mwenyewe si alienda kwa kwa, kwa nani Uh, kwa nyumba ya mtu pia huyu anaitwa Jemhesh why do we keep on doing the double standard and pretending like at at, at now we are at, at she's better si yeye pia alienda akakaa na bwana ya mtu akaanza kulilia bwana ya mtu kwa live so when you talk about men and desperation my friend kwa hiyo register ya watu wenye wako desperate for men kama una, unaita ukaro wewe pia ujiandike hapo kwa hiyo register put yourself on that register hakuna haja tujifanye hapa ati watu wengine wako desperate for men na wengine hawako desperate for men kama watu wana mark register for desperate men please make make your, mark yourself there Okaro is not responsible for Big Daddy's behavior. She's only responsible for herself. If Big Daddy akichoose kutongoza wanawake wote kwa TikTok, hiyo ina inamuhusu Okaro aje. Kwani Okaro ni watchman wa Big Daddy? She's not she's not Big Daddy's watchman. So hapa mtu akitusi mwenzake, watu waki watu wa, mtu akitu mtu akikutusi and you choose to tusi back they should not feel some type of way kama watu wameamua kutu, kutusiana ukitusi unatusiwa back na ukitusiwa back don't start saying that you demand for respect hapana no nyako is not the person to demand for respect anywhere because she is a walking a walking disrespect by herself her own identity has thrived on disrespecting people by herself yeye mwenyewe hiyo ndo kitu mimi naweza nikasema kwa hii issue. Alafu <laughs> yeah. Uh, 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 yani identity yake if, in fact if we could edit the dictionary and try to define uh, disrespect uh, nyako should be the definition of disrespect by herself. Yeye yeah, mwenyewe. So one thing I also want to make very clear mimi Diana I don't do any teams. I don't. In fact, hata huyu Okaro amekaa hapa. The last time I spoke to Okaro was how many months ago? I don't even call her. We don't call each other. We talk here on this platform. Nikikutana na kwa naye kwa platform atatoa opinion yake. I don't do teams. I don't do teams at all. And if I need to do something I don't need to go looking for people to align at siju ndio nifanye kitu that is not how I operate I'm sorry I don't Ati na kwa hii TikTok ati mtu anilipe ndio mtu akuje kuweka screenshot ati nililipwa kufanya kitu I don't do that I don't do that nonsense It's so vitu zenye mimi nafanya and I don't get paid to do anything whatever I do I do by myself I don't need anybody's opinion on it and I have only responded on this matter because my name was mentioned like I always tell you guys I respond I don't attack the fact that my name was mentioned is why I have given this opinion and my I, my, my 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 view on everything that is happening here so so but uh, the people when you anaingililia other issue yani kama hao kina tinted na nini hivyo <laughs> tu yani it's it, it, naonea huruma get involved in beef that involves you na nime mute uh, okay can i talk uh, dana rose okay i know most of us um, I've not in deep terms with Nyako, but if you say uh, at why is Nyako telling uh, Okaro 
that 50 only 50000 first nyako did not say only he only say okaro sent me 50000 and then for for nyako to speak about the 50000 okaro provoked her to speak about it because okaro said i have bought you i don't know underwears and put food in in your in your in your table that's when now uh, nyako decided to talk about it you see and then uh, when you say why are we putting other people in okaro's issue i think it's a double standard the way you you're dealing with artist issue but you're putting other people in your issue yeah because because those people chose to put themselves in that issue i was dealing with arty and other people decided to become team players kina benta kina yeko they chose to put their heads into it so and, and i was very clear ukingililia vita yenye kuhusu where peer you'll be you'll be collateral damage that's what i'm saying the same way the so same kama way uwelewi, kama uwelewi what was happening and how other players got involved in the issue between me and arty then maybe you you are you are speaking from a, a place and you don't understand i understand do you know how well. those other issues those other people came became involved in the issue okay can i do speak? you know the same way okaro is meddling into your issues when other people are talking about nyako it's the same way these other people who are friends to nyako are meddling into her issues when uh, when you you are mentioning nyako so it's the same thing it's just double standards so every team has no. to defend their people the same way okaro is defending you it's the same way akina tinte akina benta are defending nyako the same way who is defending who the same way wherever okaro goes defends you is the same way akina benta and uh, other people are defending nyako so it's a it's it's like a double standard thing so you your team is defending you and nyako's team i don't have any team her. correction i don't do teams Papa, tuna team. so i i, I, I don't a do I, team I don't do you. any teams i don't do any teams princess Pam. i'm sorry i don't do any teams i don't okay can i talk uh i know you, you don't do teams i don't do any teams there, there some, you can just talk people, you don't have to constantly say can okay. i talk just talk there are some yeah. people who like you for you it's just the way some people love nyako for her they can defend her even if they are not her team and some people can defend you even if they are not your team that's how it is hey diana kidogo ni mulize princess pam eh? defending in which manner insulting people body shaming people that is what you call defending the defending one another and you allow that and then so okaro did not did not body okaro did not uh, shame nyako how are the issues now how are the issues now but look at us here have we insulted nyako since we started to when we to imagine saya to ngelei insulting you're just saying how you want to select you want to selectively ah, talk about really really you really. want to be you want to be selective about what you are responding to like you want us to cherry pick selectively because that's what suits you princess Pam. when you talk about I, defense I think, you have I to think be very you, clear you about get, everything that you, you said in the process me. i think you didn't get me i'm saying i got you i got what you're saying you're claiming that other people are defending me and so the same way kinatinte they're also defending nyako but what the question you've been asked that there is a difference between defense and insult do you know sir, there are some people who insult nyako in other platforms uh defending you they insult her in the name of defending you but maybe you are not in those then how, what does so, that what does that what has that got to do with me because me those are not way you can the see people, people. I, those are not people those are people i don't know now i'm going to ask you a very clear question you as princess pam when she stands on her platform and you're there and you support her have you ever stood on the platform and called her out for insulting people at random because she wakes up to insult people for nothing have you ever said anything about it as a defender 
Okay, right now we are talking about the Okaro issue, right? No, now. no, 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 no. And I'm the just thing of you in, because the you are here, her you are here to talk you. about her as a person that you support. Have you ever, ever, at any point, called her out for insulting people? Have you? Yes, we have. But you see, uh, Nyako is a where she, and she when? doesn't listen. She doesn't listen. So. What okay, so because is, she doesn't listen, so she doesn't listen, so it's okay. So problem. she should just be, you know, you that, so she should just continue she, because she does not her, listen. Mm. You cannot use her past mistakes to apply to what is happening right now. What today do you mean she past not, mistakes? She today she did not just wake when? up. Today what she did not just mean? wake up. Can I speak? Today I she did not just wake what you're up. Talking about. You're she did not just wake up and start. And start insulting Okaro. Okaro is the one. Princess who Pam, let me ask you a question. You are saying past mistakes. So you mean this person, the last past, the last time this person insulted uh, someone was 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 one year ago or two years ago. No, when was the last? Do you time know that, you started, that since you started issues with with RT, When was the last time Nyako woke up and decided today Nataka Kucharaza, uh, let's say auntie. And then Auntie Ajamfanya Kitu, I'm charazi. And then I'm watching. When was the first, the, the, the first, when was the last time you had her insulting anyone without being provoked? But Pam, Pam, what is your point exactly? What is your uh, point? That is point what we are asking. They, there are some double standards. Then the, this double standard is also from your side, ma'am. It yes, is also from I your side. Double standards and also. And uh, uh, Okaro and her people, they have some double standards. That's why I'm saying right now, we, we yeah. should not condemn someone else and other people Aya. are doing the Uli same. Zeni, before we say me about double standard princess, I want to know Okaro's side. <laughs> Aya. Okaro, because uh, Okaro, people are saying, oh, Okaro, uh, U, no, ujani jibu swali yangu unataka uni mention hiyo team ya Okaro ni kina nani? There's I said it's it's not necessarily a team. There's a way people anaweza tukukupenda wewe anti without being at mimi ni anti mimi ni team anti. You see, they just like you for who you are. That's why unapatanga kuna watu wengine they agree with you 100% ata ukikuwa muongo, usikwe muongo, useme ukweli, useme ukweli. That's how that's how it goes. Mwishowe unasema nini? Mimi bado sijaelewa. Pam. Anyway, Any... wache tu muache. Uh, Miss Sunshine karibu. Pam shuka please tupe watu wengine nafasi. Wah, asante. No, okay, thanks. Wah. Makio ni shuka, upatia nafasi wa twenkini. Ni sawa, S1, sawa. Thank you. Kisha my dear. Muda nkuvunja mkongo. Thank you so much for your gifts. Mi instansha ni maiki kwa 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 nyagere, nyagere. Goja kidogo, nyagere. Nyangere Ngoja kidogo minisansha At least wetu na juwe Nyangere Nyangere fungua mic Haya mshukisha ni tuonge na minisansha Please minisansha ni chukua mic mami Thank you thank you Auntie Makio Asante ni sana kwa kunipanti Nalikuwa nataka tu kunini 2.1 Mimi chanyi nilikuwa nasema Okaro first of all girl Respect 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 for making that stand for pointing you up putting your points out there simple and clear very eloquent na wenye watakuwa wata wanaelewa wamelewa wenye hawajaelewa hata usiwashughulikie really really for today i was just saluting you caro brenda that's the way to go you go girl that's the right way kwa wale watu wengine ama kwa hizo mambo zingine watu waache hapa kukuja hapa ku pinpoint ama ku point out wakina Okaro for example eti sijui amemtukana nani na nani who started Okaro was so humble Omba, Okaro alisema yeye hataki kukua in that vicinity in that circle where the other lady was na akashuka with respect what happened 
mwingine anakuja juu anaanza kumpop anaenda kum, anaanza kumwambia aende aoshe mavi for real and then akiritaliate inakuwa sasa yeye ni mbaya people you will have to stop you will have to learn how to respect each other kama we, kama nyinyi wenyewe hamjielewi na hamji respect Uwezi kukosea kila mtu hapa hivi heshima na wa, wakuwe tu akifuatilia tu eh hivyo 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 mimi chenye nilikuwa nataka kusema respect is paramount respect kata kama uji, uji respect respect watu wengine na kama hauta wa respect they will force you to respect them or they'll cut you off their lives it's that simple thank you thank you haya um, mama gp hebu ongea hi everyone mambo fiki Okay, mimi nataka kuambia Ukaro uh, I love how mature she is. Na don't mind what people will say, just be you. This is like this mamie, usmind what people will say. Thank you. Thank you Mama JB Rose. Thank you so much for that alishuka. Rose. Sasa anti mwakio. Niti. Mimi nataka kusema ukweli na usinishukishe. Bora tu usitumie matusi kwa life yangu. Kindly. Eh situkana ni mwakio kusema ukweli si hata wewe uanga unatukana watu. Nakumbuka hata ukikuja hii TikTok ulianza na mtoto wa nyako. So mbona wewe unaingilia nyako sana? Alafu kwa after gift tu wake unaingia kwa inbox zao mwakio hata wewe sio mtu mzuri. Kama unasema nyako anatukana watu na kuangalia tu nyako na body shame watu wewe ndio mkubwa wa hizo tabia kuanzia Facebook. Mbona sasa hii unaingilia ile foto ile usishe kapata majusta wake. Nisikie Rose, usiongea haraka haraka ukishake. Ongea tu pole pole. Have your time. Uko na 10 hours za kuongea. Eh continue. Eh mbona sasa tukisema ukweli wewe unaingilia nyako sana unaonekana unataka Alafu ulivyo mjinga uko very comfortable kuniletea unyambi sasa hapa kwa live yangu. Yaani nimekwambia uko comfortable afu ndio umekaa sasa vizuri. Why are you shaking? <laughs> If you're saying the truth. Eh? Wewe unajua nilikuwa mbaya yes and I have changed. Niliingilia mtoto wa nyako yupi? Kwanza yupi mtoto gani? Eh? Mtoto yupi? Niliingilia mtoto wa nyako yupi? Niliwambia ganyinyi gugu you don't even think. You don't think. Unasikia? Hata wewe mwenyewe kuongea kwako hujiamini. Mwangeo, wewe mdada wewe. Why are you crying? Madam, why are you crying? Hiyo ndio kweli. Hiyo ndio kweli yako sweetheart. Acha nikupigie makofi na ukweli yako. which bitter truth which bitter truth surely you know i used to insult people yes na sijai kata and i've changed hata kwa ile vyangu mesetangu nianze nimetuka kwanza hebu niambie nimetuka na mtoto wako wapi eh akia mungu nyinyi gugu nature ni maskini na warumia sana ani na waurume hivi sasa nikuulize yani hivi umekuja kuongea ujinga yani hata uone aibu kwani are you feeling are you feeling intimidated wacha niwaambie this is a platform where we will speak about everybody kama nyinyi mnanunulika mmeamua kutetea mtu it's not here it's not going to happen on my platform sawa and then yuko kwa tinted huko Uko na sikia mwenye ambaye ameweka picha yenye ambaye niliweka kwa TikTok yangu amechukua huko ndo mna staili mwende mkakae. Uko mwende mtu wa sire zenu, mwakio natukana, mwakio ni mbaya, mwakio tukana watoto wa nyako, mwakio tukana bwana wa nyako, mwakio tukana baba wa nyako. Uko where that is where you, you, are, you belong. Are we together? Mimi usinletee utoto wenu hapa. Na niliwaambia I don't depend on you. Nyinyi endeleeni ku Hiyo ni kazi yenu. Na hapa kwangu msikuje kunipwekea boykea ovyo ovyo kama mbwa mnyuru. Unajua anga wale mbwa kuro wenye wanazunguka gaga streets za Mombasa na behave kama yao. So hapa msinilete, sawa? Okay. Unu kweli gani wao shwali? 
Surely able to get it in. But then, do you know even the meaning of saying ukweli? Uni ukweli gani? Sema, you use and uh, it is past tense and we don't thrive with past. Are we together? Nini nyako wenu leo ambie, leo situkani? Kesho tasika, yeah, she's changed. Hata jamaliza siku. Mbwa! Mtoto wa malaya. Kanyonyeshe mbwa. Alafu wewe uko na nguvu ya kuja kuni address mimi. Go and address your present, please. Let's start from there. Address your present, then come to me. Okay? Woo! Okay? Mambwa kuro. Wale wanazungaga Mombasa. Wale ukimrushia, ukimfanya bu! Wanaikamkia kwa mataku ndo nyinyi. Kwa hivyo msijaribu kuniletea. And I'm going, I'm not going to tolerate you until you behave. If you behave, muna act kama humans, that is when me and you will tutakete table moja. But if this is what you are going to do, is weka weka ovyo ovyo, hapa kwangu will not sit. Mutakuwa mnaenda mkiingia ukiongea kitu unapaishwa, ukipaishwa. Paka mjua kurespectu watu ni nini. Paka hizo matusi mtawacha. Kama mimi niliwacha, pia nini mtawacha. Tena hapa kwangu ni by fire. By force. Thank you. Niseme ni miacha matusi, alafu nije ni tolerate matusi. Am I stupid? Wa vipwe. Anyway. Let's move on safely. Nani ya meingia?